All right, good day, welcome. So reading number two, I guess, all right? Spirit was kind of giving me a little something while I was getting myself ready. Hearing this song that I've heard on the radio before, it's called, I think it's called Speechless, I'm not sure. I don't know who even sings it. But it's like somebody is somebody's weakness, but they have to watch from a distance. All right, so let's see what we have going on here. All right, so we do have the love call. So somebody might want to express themselves. But yeah, it's like somebody really has a lot of like feelings and emotions. Um, but they can't do nothing is what I'm getting just besides watching you and admiring you. Somebody thinks you're very beautiful, very alluring. We have the cassette. Yeah, somebody's replaying things over and over in their head while they look at your photographs here. All right, they're doing a lot of, a lot, a lot, a lot of thinking here. I feel like they have some outdated ways of thinking that could have caused something that could have been what got in the way of this, but they miss you and they're replaying, you know, memories over and over when it comes to you. They want to make new memories is what I'm getting here, the clock here, but it takes time. Okay, so this is an energy that is in divine timing. It cycles. All right, so that could be some here. And then we have the abundance. All right. So, yeah, you guys are going to meet up. You guys are going to get together eventually. All right, because I feel like the more positive a mindset you have, the more you manifest this back into your life here. But there is cycles and healing and progress that needs to happen here i did see the runner so it could be a masculine doing this here so give me here for the cassette and the photographs please so i feel like it's just a lot of like i don't know i'm getting the vibe of maybe like a past life type of energy here no underneath the cupid's arrow is the twin flame with the coffee cup all right so you guys here God damn it. You guys here are going to end up meeting up. So this is the flame reading. All right. Which makes sense with the cycles. All right. The healing work. All right. For the cassette and the photographs, if I can get to that, please. For the cassette and the photographs. We have the magician. So yeah, somebody's got a lot of desire for you is what I'm getting. Um, this is a beautiful. I'm also getting they might even create new things in their head. But there's that manifestation here. But I'm getting just a lot of desire when they look at your photographs, when they replay these memories. All right. So they're just kind of casting like fantasy is what I'm getting. We got the star card. Could be dealing with an Aquarius. Could be dealing with a Virgo. All right. So yeah, it takes time to heal. We see that here with the clock card. Remain optimistic. All right. When it comes to this, you guys have the ability to heal this and go towards your abundance. There's manifestation here. We have the magician here for the abundance. We have the magician here and then we have the abundance that speaks about positive mindset manifest what it is that you want here. So, yeah, it's showing here that, you know, the more positive you think, the more better this is going to come along. You got to show gratitude towards this. All right. But we have the moon here. There's a lot of hidden emotions here. So that could be some of the issues. Somebody was struck by Cupid's arrow, some type of meeting, invitation, something. But somebody's feeling a little hesitant. So let's get a final outcome here for these flames. So we do have Pisces, Aquarius, Virgo. We have all major arcanas out. And I think when I did Aquarius, they had all major arcanas. I think it was like over five of them. Their whole reading. And then the one card that wasn't was the Nine of Cups. So we have the Sun with the Queen of Wands here. That's your outcome. Positive renewal. Positive mindset brings positive renewal brings beautiful energy with the sun into your life very vibrant like the fucking empress like look at this two very sexy classy determined women all right men love this shit 
all right because she's beautiful she's self-made she's just beautiful in all areas very powerful very courageous and determined and then you have very nurturing loving abundant energy here we have the abundance right here all right so obvious we have the ace of swords here somebody's going to get clarity i feel like spirit the divine is helping with the lovers here bring you guys back together all right <clears throat> so this has the potential this is a higher up relationship with the ace of swords the hierophant and the lovers yeah this is a highly evolved relationship this is a twin flame relationship it's all about having those breakthroughs all right so i'm going to leave that there because it doesn't really need to go any further it's very positive with all these major arcanas we have the star we have the empress the moon the magician and the sun card all right with the queen of wands it's beautiful energy so i'm going to leave that there so focus on having a positive mindset so you can manifest this beautiful abundance um into your life show gratitude towards it all right you guys have a good day